Well, some of the impacts of last week's weather are still being felt today. Ardmore just got their water turned on. But other cities, like Arab, didn't have those problems. Way 31 anchor Rob Sneed spoke with the Arab Water Works. He joins us live now with how they avoided problems with their pipes. Yeah, the water department's general manager told me that people who live in the area, they did what they were supposed to do. Ardmore's mayor told me that he's still trying to figure out what went wrong. The faucets are back on in Ardmore after days of no water. Some of the folks that live there say they had to melt snow for water. Ardmore Mayor Billy Shannon says right now city officials are still trying to figure out what happened. I, I, I personally think it was a, a system wide and of course I can't predict what Limestone County's problem was, but I know one thing, they didn't have the water to supply us. He also says problems could have started when folks tried to let their faucets drip. Maybe that takes a lot more water than we all know. Over in Arab, it was the complete opposite. Ted Hyatt with Arab Waterworks says they barely saw any major problems. Crews were ready. We had plenty of extra fuel. We had uh, all of our equipment. We had our repair clamps, stuff that we knew that we'd probably gonna need. We made sure that we had plenty and extra. Hyatt says there were a couple of things that worked. One, they had plenty of crews to deal with issues as they came about, and two, Folks in the community did exactly what they were told. Keep your water on drip. Uh, I do feel like the customers are more prepared this time uh, because of our call outs to help customers with frozen water or busted pipes was uh, very less than normal. Hyatt also told me that he's already discussing ways to handle the next round of snow. With coverage you can count on, Rob Sneed, Way 31 News.